Hey guys, Original here, and today we're playing Fallout 3, and we're back! How did I just do that? Oh, it's alt. Oh, we got dog meat. Oh, he's so cute. Um, so last episode we were looking for the, the, the brotherhood, I mean the family. I have no clue, man. I don't know where to go. Are they here? The pointer thing, thing points to here, but I don't know where they are. I don't want to Google it, but honestly, at this point, I don't know where else to check, you know? I don't know, man. I don't know. Let's come out the other side. Um. Why is there a marker here? And the marker is here. So, I guess it has to be somewhere around here. What the fuck is that? I guess let's check around the area some more. But, it should be somewhere around here. I think everything's so gray and faded out, man. The fuck? Oh. Get on, dog. The fuck? Dude, how do I? I want to shoot dog meat. It's a thing here. Just gonna shoot you in the face. There we go. Dude, what is the accuracy, man? Sniper, I lease up my pistol of doom. Oh, my God, I suck. Let's go. Dude, that raider fucked. Bark, bark. I need you to find it for me. How do I know is he? I gotta, I look at the mod for this. And like, how much health he has, and to make him invincible. Or at least just make him invincible, because if he, if he dies, I'm gonna cry again. Where's he, dog meat? It's a blowfly! Get it! Get it, boy! No, why am I shooting dog meat? Why would I shoot. It's a mole rat behind me, nice, good to know. Ew. Where's the mole right at, baby? No, he's over there, he doesn't even see me. No dog meat, bad boy.
Doug, we know. Whatever. I guess we attracted it. Where's Doug going to, man? Holy shit, we just fucked that kid. Oh my god, I almost shot him in the face. Doug, me, you almost took that shot. Where the fuck is the fucking family, dude? They're supposed to be at the scrapyard, but where the fuck is, are they actually at? I don't get it, man. I don't get it. Oh. There's someone around here. Oh, yeah. I don't want to mess with that shit. I think it looks scary. Um, I don't understand, man. I don't know where to go. I guess you can check the tunnels again because it's somewhere in here. Maybe you can check. Maybe there's a door we missed or something. That's where we came from. All right. Maybe we can walk through here, maybe? Oh, and we can. Okay. Oh, that was just... God damn it. I didn't even see that back there. Give me with the fucking fucking baseball. So I guess this is where the hideout's supposed to be. Ooh, a baseball. Value ten? Oh, let's take that. Meyer alert. Isn't like a crab or some shit? Be careful, dog meat. Un cuidado, my señor. Fuck me. One right there. Let's be careful here. I could just leave and heal. Hit me now, dude. God damn it, dude. Playing to all these traps, man. How do I disarm this shit? <laughs> Jump over it. That was lame. They hit me with the pack of meat. Hello? You you look friendly. What's the big idea? What up, homie? You gonna whoa, kill me? Whoa, whoa, slow down there. This area is off limits to everyone but the family. Where the hell do you think you're going? Oi. All right, all right. Oh, it worked. Let's go. Let's if go. If I were you, I'd speak to Vance before you poke around too much. You can usually find him on the mezzanine overlooking the common area. We are a badass gang, and we don't take shit from nobody. Oh, yeah. 
We also don't like nosy assholes who creep around asking too many stupid All right, questions. you want to fucking die, Robert? Just remember, I... All right, I can't be doing nothing too crazy because I'm low on health. Ian, where you at? Ian! What the way, dog meat? Should be around here somewhere, right? I feel like. Oh, it's you again. What's up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I just wanted to listen, listen up on that. I feel like it'd be it's some good lore. Okay, so he's definitely around here somewhere. I guess we can. I'm gonna try to steal shit later, but for now we're just gonna try to find it. Oh, we can try to steal that med kit. Yeah, let's try to steal that real quick. Lost karma. Oh well. We need those stem packs, anyways. Oh, yeah, we gotta go, we go this way. We gotta pat up our leg, our broken leg. <laughs> now, we're, now we have a leg. <laughs> items. 15 stem pack, that's a lot. That's a lot, a lot. Let me save here. Should probably put another save. Whatever. Just add another save, why not? Ian, where you at, homie? This will be like church or something. Oh shit, oh shit, I'm gonna... What does the boy have to say? Hello? Are you gonna? Are you Ian? Advance. Monsters. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Criminals. My fault, guys. Animals. Every one of us has been branded with these insults at some point in our lives. But why? The fuck was the video? That different from those who hunt the meat fuck? To survive, or for those Yo, turn up this fucking radio. What the fuck? Shut the fuck up. 
Ben's explanation to this hellish existence. Oh, rip, man. The adaptation we were given wasn't meant to be ignored or persecuted. What do you think, dog? It's our way of survival. We cannot yeah, allow me too. humans to hunt us down and kill us like dogs. We must show them we are a force to be reckoned with. Well, rest easy now, my brothers and sisters. Dog, wait, get the fuck it's out of here. Your hot ass breath. Dog, get the. Ooh, I'll get. I'll heal you up a little bit. Stop all of the running, all of the hiding, and all of the denying. Dude, hot as we breath, bro. We will prepare, we will teach you to cope with your differences, and we will keep you alive. We are the family, and together we will stand united. United! Hello there, stranger. What up, homie? Be a fast store leader. Great, Catch actually. Me there, I finished my first round of studies, and Vance said that I was doing What the way, Doc, me? I'm finally beginning to get the hang of it. Yep. I don't. Oh shit! Is she a hoe? A a sh well, well, I'm surprised you don't know me. I'm Brianna. I take care of the men around here. Well, yep, she's a hoe. Married ones, anyway. Stray hoeing. Vance has him in meditation right now. No one's supposed to be in there. Poor kid. He looks like he could use another friend. Well, that is sweet, but Vance would kick my rather gorgeous ass right out of here if I told you how to find Ian. Sorry. Oh. Bye, sweetie. Short amount of time. Well, talk to Vance. Around, I guess. Yeah, Carl, where's Vance at? Vance? That's Alan. Vance? That's Justin. Yeah, shut up. Where's Vance at? Where the fuck did Vance go to, bruh? Just ran. I thought I you. knew everyone in the family, but I don't recognize you. You must be one of Vance's new initiates. My name's Justin. I'm pretty new here myself. Ian, what do you want from him? Shit. Uh, when she's needed at home, does that mean like home as in like? It's outsiders' perspectives that drove him here in the first place. Fuck. Sorry, I can't really help you. Fuck. Yes, I know. He told me. Surprised? Well, Ian was there when it happened and did nothing to stop it. If you ask yourself why. The answer is obvious. What? He belongs with us here. He's one of us. Don't deny him his rightful home. All right, Justin, you an idiot. No, just that Vance said he isn't to be disturbed while he's in meditation. How do you know that? If you've spoken to him like I have, I think you can see he's truly one of us. Ian confides in me. We share a special bond. All right. I might be the only friend in the world he's got. All right, Justin. I understand. Goodbye. All right, Justin. You need to calm down. Where's Vance at? Vance Refrigeration. Where you at? Vance Refrigeration. Welcome to Maresti. Welcome to our home. My people call me Vance. My people. I lead this group of weary travelers and outcasts who need a home. And to what do I owe the pleasure of your visit? What you see before you is the last bastion of hope for the downtrodden and misunderstood. It is a sanctuary for the oppressed and a beacon of faith for the terrorists. It sounds like a, uh, like a cult leader, you know? I'm going to allow me to continue. We are the remnants of society, cast aside like the clean-picked bones of a hunter's feast. I led my flock beneath the sun-baked sands of the wasteland to keep them safe and teach them my ways. Men of science would call us cannibals, eaters of human flesh. Society labels us as monsters, demons, and the unclean. 
Oh, so they eat. Eh? Oh, so they eat people, huh? Oh, yeah, no. Oh, oh, wait, so. Is that why they bit off, like, their necks? The, the, the West. No, was it the West family? Yeah, 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 it was the West family. The one I originally went to, like, a few episodes ago. So that's why their necks were, like, bitten up and shit. So, like, eat. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. We still haven't, we don't still, we still don't have that explained on as how they died, you know? We always have, like, bite marks on their neck, just chewed down to the bone. Wow, you're a real humanitarian. I find your choice of words quite droll, but that is what I have come to expect from your kind. Are you calling me stupid? People like you call for our extermination or reform. Reforming implies something is wrong with us and needs to be eliminated. I think of my teachings as more of an improvement, a way to transcend our cannibalistic nature. Oh. Uh. Your open-mindedness is very rare for a human. I find that fascinating. Allow me to bolster your insight with a lesson in objectivity. I say we are no longer cannibal, only consuming the blood of our prey. What would that make us in your eyes? Then that is a mystery you will have to solve on your own. In ceremony, each member of the family must speak one of the laws. It is theirs to remember and to enforce. Perhaps from these laws you can discover what we are. Return to me when you are ready. Holy shit, man. Any notes? The Pazza family's main terminal is T. Okay, so I can figure out where he is from there. So we gotta find the main terminal. Alright, dog me, let's look for it. Are we too stupid to handle this? Ah, yes we are, friends. Even in this mission, we're so fucking idiots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a bad boy. Sword can I lift? Fuck! Oh, if you get a sword, dude? That'd be so dope. I don't want any of that shit. Get a fucking sword, that'd be so dope. Oh shit, uh. What was the pass? It requires a key, but it was. T. Oh, what the fuck? I don't know. Oh shit, I didn't mean to shoot that. So we can either play Guns of Blazing and kill everyone. I don't, I don't think we can do that to be honest though. Or we can uh, look for the terminal. We got those two choices there for us. So now you figure out where the terminal is. I'm assuming it should be somewhere in this big area. Well, well. I haven't had a customer in a while. Last one I oh. had was a bit chewy. Know what I mean? Oh yeah. If your caps are good, you can buy whatever you like. Beat standing there drooling all over my merchandise. Take the ammo. Uh, what guns do we have again? Let's look for ammo here. A knife. He's a knife. He's a rifle. Oh shit, that looks dope. A lead pipe. Sledgehammer. Spike knuckles. Oh, yeah, that. Apparel. Radiation suit. I like how all these outfits are probably from people he's eaten.
All right, how much do we have? Hunting rifle, we need some point thirty-two. We'll take those. Took all the 10 darts, what the hell is that for? the wrong ammo whatever let's see what else uh, I guess we take some more 556 five, ammo yeah why not take all your fucking ammo I kind of want to try that that gun out where is it the laser rifle combat shit. oh my god did you get so much shit dude not gonna lie, you got some, you got some dope uh, stuff to pick from, my friend. Yeah, you can take that. And now we can sell you some shit. Give you a baseball. I'll give you an empty syringe. I'll give you uh, uh, that's it really. I'll be honest with you. Yeah, that's it. Another satisfied customer. Do I look like a fucking babysitter? All right, homie. I don't know where he is. Even if I did, I wouldn't tell you anyway. All right, you shit fucker. Now that's more like it. I finally won't have to pay for it anymore. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> I will. Here's the password to the pit squeak's room. Come back and see me after you talk to him. Oh, shit, bro. <laughs> oh, shit. Say it ain't so. Oh shit, bruh. Alright, I'm out of you. This is gross ass. Alright, so we don't need to go to the terminal anymore. We can just go to Ian's room. So now we need to figure out where Ian is. It's a big thing here. Please don't take Ian away from us. Ah, too bad, Justin. Shut the fuck up. Fucking idiot. Don't even think of breaking into that. Yeah, 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 fucker. Shut up. Why are you looking at me like that? Just wait until I take Ian away. And then you'd be like, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, it's right here, right? Hey, that's not the. Shit. Okay, here it is. Door released, okay. Is that it? Talk to me, you see outside. We're gonna save real quick. Huh? Uh, what do you want? Why is his voice like that? What the hell? You have bitch to find. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. I'm sure Evan King is pretty pissed right about now. I bet he has the entire town out looking for me. He's worse than my parents. Home? I don't have a home anymore. He killed them all right. That, didn't I? I killed them. My own parents. It was the fucking hunger. That thing that's haunted me my entire life. You must think I'm some sort of monster. There's something inside me, something completely messed up. I'm a mutant, a fucking freak. The only person I was ever able to talk to was my sister Lucy, and she's gone. No one gives a shit about me except Vance and the family. Can't you understand that? She, she really misses being home, and she's asked about me and here a lot. I think I had it all wrong. I shouldn't have come here. I bet Lucy is feeling just as bad as me. Please, tell Vance I've made my decision. I'm going home to Arfu. I hope to see you there as well. I'm just gonna gather my stuff together and say my goodbyes, then I'll head on back. Now, um, not to be uh, pessimistic or anything, but I don't think it's gonna go as smoothly as you think, Ian. I don't think he's just gonna let you walk out, but you know, I don't know. Come, let's go, Doc. Let's go, boy. Ian, you uh, take a nap. I'll handle this. 
before I go though. Anything, anything else in here I can steal? Ooh. Ooh cake. No, I don't think there's anything else. God, I'm so fucking dumb, man. I really set up good science. I hear that you decided to speak to Ian regardless of my warnings. Yes, I have, friend. Be that as it may, I am still interested in what you conversed Ooh. about. <laughs> Did he come to a decision? Yes, he has. As long as you maintain this level of civility, please proceed. No convincing is necessary. I must say your visit is a pleasant change from what I am accustomed to when dealing with humans. Wow. In light of this, I promise you that no further harm will befall you or Erafu. Of that, you have my solemn oath. Now, what of young Ian? Tell me his Gosh, decision. shit. Ian, you sure you want to say? If you fear a reprisal from the family regarding his decision, know that I would never hold it against you. And as for Ian having you speak in his place, I find his trust sufficient enough to accept what you say is true. All right. It saddens me to lose one of my flock, but I believe everyone has to follow their own path. All I was attempting to do was guide him. Now it seems that responsibility has fallen upon you. I hope you will be more successful. Please, I want you to take this. Consider it as an apology oh. to you for all the hardships you had to endure. It's not going to kill me. Place. Goodbye, human. Our time together has been rather educational. Oh shit, dude. Wow. He actually didn't kill me. Schematics, a work, what's a gas tank? Well, not a use, probably use it, but two different functions of the flashing. Ooh, yeah, that sounds dope. Might have to go for that. Wow, oh, I did not expect it to be that easy. I thought he was gonna murder us and, like, you know? Ian, let's get the fuck out of here. I wanted to thank you one last time for what you've done for me. Ian, why My is your brain voice like that? feels like less of a mess now. I think I may be seeing clearly for the what first you time you? in years. What are you Lucy, man? Don't worry about me. I've been through a lot, but I think I'm gonna be okay. And you just killed your parents, though. It actually kind of makes me feel better to talk about it. Go ahead. Like, give me, can we, can we, I want, can I like sit down? I want to like, I'm in this weird like position, whatever. I wish I could answer that. I really do. I don't even remember it happening. When the hunger takes over, it's like being pushed aside, like something else is controlling me. I can see what's happening, but can't close my eyes. I don't even remember exactly what happened until Vance knocked on the door. That's the weird thing. He has some sort of crazy sixth sense about or something. Maybe all of our kind do. As soon as I was with the family, I really felt at home for the first time in my life. It's like all these people are my real brothers and sisters. I mean... Honestly, if you like, if you're like fucked up, right? I don't think the best thing for you to do is go back to Arafu, because like, you kill everyone else. Vance told me later that he was basically covering for me and allowing the family to to feed at the same time. Since my parents were already dead, they drank their blood and left the mark on the wall. He didn't want Evan to suspect that I had done it. The irony is they were stalking our town to feed anyway. It's almost like Vance knew this would happen. I don't remember how long I sat there on the floor staring at my parents' bodies. It seemed like days I wanted to feed, to eat their flesh. But it was like a little bit of me was holding on. Then, out of nowhere, there was shouting outside and a knock at the door. I opened it, and it was Vance. Vance he seemed to know exactly how I was feeling inside. He took me under his arm and we left. I never looked back. Yeah, okay. I suppose not. 
I was about 10 years old, and I was playing with Lucy down under the overpass. We loved throwing rocks in the water. We saw some wastelander trying to break open the Brahmin pens and steal one of them, so I ran over and told him to stop. He just laughed and pushed me away. When I fell, suddenly my head started to hurt, and my eyes got all blurry. It was almost like I blacked out. Next thing I know, Lucy was pulling me off the guy. I had ripped his throat open with my teeth. Holy shit. She said I, like, changed into another person, that I even glared at her and raised my arms like I was going to kill her. The Wastelander took a swing at me with some kind of club. I turned around and jumped on him. I tore his throat open with my teeth. If he wouldn't have done that, Lucy may have been killed, too. I just don't know. Lucy said Mom and Dad would never have understood. She told me to keep what I did a secret and that she'd try and help me. Thanks to Lucy, she was able to stop that from ever happening again for years. Every time I'd feel the hunger, she'd hold on to me and not let go. After a while, the hunger almost seemed to go away until, well... I don't know. I really don't. I mean, I'm not totally dumb. I know they were in stories and all that. But who knows, maybe Vance is right and vampires were just people like us who learned to control their hunger and drink only blood. I mean, vampires are regarded as feared monsters instead of hunted animals like cannibals. Kind of makes sense. Oh, it's a really weird perspective. Yeah, okay. I came in being like, yeah, they're all sick fucks eating humans, but like... Yeah. It's not like they had a choice, you know? They were just dealt the hand of God! You know? They had no choice. So I don't blame them. Uh, goodbye, Vance. Refrigeration. The dope-ass sword. I'm gonna... Ah, you've returned. Yes, I have. And I'm leaving. Bye. Uh, definitely gonna come back and steal that sword. I'm gonna keep that in mind. Because I actually do want to steal that sword. His sword. I'm listening. Please don't take Ian away from us. Oh, he's leaving, Justin. So go get a new friend. I have a special bond with Ian. I'm like the only friend of him in the whole world. Shut up. Fucking idiot. I mean, am I hidden? I'm detected. Well, I guess I'll be I'll steal that later, another time. Another time. So I guess I took the right path by going down this way. We go check we could also check down here I guess. Make sure we're not stepping anything. This is a cave, I don't wanna deal with this. I don't wanna I don't wanna deal with that shit. Let's just go home. Let's go home dog meat. Let's get out of here.